Did you look at everybody else when you're out there and go, man, because Cal said this, we are really a big team when mm -hmm. you have the guards out there and the big men. Uh, yeah, we are big. Uh, that's just going to help us rebound a lot. And uh, everybody can dribble too. So the faster we are and uh, get it up the court, it'll be easier for us to score. Saw a lot of Derek today. Is this something you guys see a lot in practice as well? Oh, yeah, definitely. Derek's a great shooter. Um, we try not to leave him open as much because he'll knock it down. And uh, he just does it all the time. Awesome. Thanks, bro. James, do you surprise yourself at all? Uh, not really. Uh, I know this is just my game, and uh, I finally got to show everybody what I'm really capable of. But this is just the beginning, and I got a lot more to go. James, do you realize you had uh, seven steals in this game? <laughs> no, I did not. <laughs> I was just playing defense. Uh, coach is a real big defensive player, so we've been working on our defense a little bit, but we still got a long, long ways to go. So. Pretty impressed. Has shooting always been your forte? As far as being able to knock them down from the counter? Yeah, uh, being left-handed, uh, I guess they said it's being a better shooter, but I never thought of it like that. But I was, I've just always been a shooter growing up. Back when I was back in the AAU, I just sit in the corner and shoot. Until uh, till I got here, I developed my game, and uh, I can shoot from around the court now. So. You prefer, what do you prefer in a particular corner? Um, being a left-hander? Um, not really, just any corner, really. How was the scrimmage compared to some some of your practices? Was it just as, as physical? Was it just kind of just the same. Like it was practice is always like that. Uh, it was just nothing but a scoreboard at it this time. Uh, practice is always hard, we're always going competitive, full out, and uh, we have a long ways to go still. But it was just showing everybody what we can do. What was the toughest part of that these last few weeks? Um, just being under control. Just reading defense, not going too fast, and uh, just going under control, finishing the ball. We got we got a pretty long team, so going against this, nobody's going to be this long in the country, and um, you know just going against these guys really helped me a lot, prepared me. You've always been comfortable. I know full court, just getting it and going. Is it is it a half court adjustment to have the ball in your hands as much and, and be on the perimeter? Uh, yeah, I just gotta you know play with more pace and you know read def defenses more. If they back up, shoot the ball and just be comfortable. You know, like. Biggest thing is coaches letting us make mistakes and learning from it. So it's been an easy adjustment. Did Cal ask you to play on the perimeter, or did you ask him, and, or did you know before you ever got here that was coming? No, I knew before I got here. I knew he was going to prepare me for whatever is best for me, you know, whatever is best, you know, at the next level. So I knew he was preparing me for future, and um, that's why I came here. So right about then, you were glad you told your mom you were going to dribble everywhere you went. No. When you were little? Oh, yeah, yeah, I did. I did tell her that. Julius, right then before you came out second half, you had the jump stop, double shoulder shimmy, fade away off glass. It's pretty Kobe -esque. Is that part of the evolution? <laughs> is that part of the evolution of the game, the work you put in the summer? Uh, yeah, I mean, our coaches do a great job of, of just, um, you know, developing our skills, you know, making sure we don't have any weaknesses. And, you know, the uh, biggest thing is we're, we're playing fast, we're playing, you know, up tempo, but uh, coach is not letting us make mistakes and we're learning from it, so we're getting more comfortable with it. Yet compared to last year, I mean, there was a lot of talking on the court last year that we didn't see from the Kentucky team last year. Um, well, I'm not really sure. I mean, is that just your guys' natural? Or is that something Calipari's really Yeah, he, he really emphasizes um, talking on the court, so. Now, is Derek's performance tonight pretty much in line with what he's been doing in practices? Yeah, definitely. We're, I mean, nobody was surprised with Derek that's on the team or on the staff. So, I mean, that's what Derek does every day. So. I've asked all the guys this. What was your favorite part about tonight? Um, I mean, of course, the cr uh, getting out and playing in front of, the, of a crowd instead of, a, um, instead of practicing. But, I mean, we're just excited to get the season started. I guess that was a, that was a season opener, sort of. Calipari said he sends you guys stats after every scrimmage. How much do you all look at that, and how much does that ratchet up the competition, if at all, between well, you guys? Well, I'm not really sure um, about, I mean, how other guys look at it, but I'm, I know I look at mines as much as possible, and and and, and it helps me uh, just concentrate on little things that I'm not doing, like rebounding and and, and uh, getting less turnover. So, I mean, the stats that they're, they send us is uh, it's really helpful. What's the first one you look at? Versus one I look at. I mean, they're all like, you know, I really don't. Which one are you most interested in improving? Um, definitely my.
field goal percentage, so I have to take better shots and just knock easier, easy shots down all the time. You gonna attempt to tell your brother not to play today? No, not. He wanted to play. He was. I mean, he was playing fine when he was out there. For you guys, you know, <laughs> Manus is going out there. It's like making your entrance. What was today like? What did you want to show everybody? We want to. I mean, Big Blue Madness, we weren't, we didn't go out and play as hard as we could. And we just want to go out and show everybody that we play really hard, play good defense, and we play together as a team. How, uh, what, what was your sort of vantage point on, on Julius's two highlight reels, the one right on Marcus and the, and the crossover? What, what do those plays sort of illustrate about the kind of ability he has? I mean, that's what he does. I mean, I expect it from him. You know, I don't expect anything less from him, so, I mean, you got to try to figure out how to stop it. I mean, good luck. <laughs> James, James said that the scrimmage tonight was kind of like the practice of Ben. It was no surprise. Is he scoring that much in all those practices? Yeah. Uh, uh, James is a sensational scorer, uh, and he can put the ball in the hoop. So, um, you know, what he did tonight was, you know, a mirror image of what he does in practice. And, I mean, it carries over. I mean, that's the most important thing, at least it's carrying over to, you know, a game setting.